We're looking at the new HC65 headlamp from Nikkor in today's video. This upgrade to the popular HC60 headlamp includes new red and high CRI outputs to give this already powerful headlamp even more utility. A primary Cree CML2 U2 LED produces a 1000 lumen beam with 120 yards of throw. Useful for everything from cycling and caving to setting up camp and more. The main output can be adjusted through 5 brightness levels for complete control. For up close work and reading, switch to the secondary high CRI output which offers up to 26 lumens of warm, sunlight like light. If you're trying to preserve your night vision or signal to others, use the secondary 11 lumen red output. This mode is also useful for hunting as the red light is invisible to many predators eyes. The HC65 is controlled entirely via a conveniently located dual switch. Similar to camera shutter, the button will react differently depending on how hard it is pressed. To turn on the headlamp to the previously used mode, press the button completely. Once the light is on, press the button halfway to cycle through ultra low, low, mid, high, and turbo. To turn the headlamp off, press the button completely again. The HC65 will memorize the mode you were in for the next time. To access the high CRI output, half press the button for a half a second. To exit, press the button again. Either half press or full press will work. Finally, the red LED is accessed by pressing and holding the button completely for about a half a second. Exit the red LED the same way as the high CRI with either a full or half press on the button. There are also three special modes accessible when either the main or high CRI light is turned on. Simply press and hold the button for about a half a second and the light will enter strobe. Tap the button halfway to cycle through SOS and beacon. Press and hold the switch to exit special modes. Here's a look at the beam shots for the HC65, including all five primary brightnesses the high CRI output and red output. The HC65 runs on a single 18650 battery which is included in the package. In a pinch, two CR123A batteries can also be used. Charging the HC65 can be done via the built-in charging port. To access, first unscrew the cap covering the USB port located near the power switch. Next, plug the included USB cable into any available power source and the light will begin to charge. A blue indicator light will blink to indicate charging and illuminate steady upon completion. Out of the box, the HC65 includes the headlamp, an adjustable headband, USB charging cable, spare o-rings, instruction manual, and warranty card.